Hello and welcome to The Charismatic Voice, a scientific and practical guide to making your voice better. In this episode, we'll be discussing the whistle register. This is the highest region of a human voice. When you hear Mariah Carey riff so high that it's off the end of the piano, that's whistle register. A vocal registration is a neighboring set of sung notes that are similar in tone quality, sensation, and physical production. The tone quality of whistle register sounds small, sometimes squeaky, and unsurprisingly, like a whistle. Whistle is the least understood vocal register. And that's because the epiglottis, a piece of cartilage, partially covers the vocal folds during whistle. We do know for sure that only a small part of the vocal folds are actually vibrating, which is totally different from other vocal registers which vibrate across the full length. A lot of people make the mistake of squeezing or putting a ton of pressure on the voice to try to find whistle. While there should be a little pressure, whistle tone should feel relatively gentle with minimal effort. To access your whistle register, try making a sound like a squeaking mouse or a whining puppy. And if this isn't working for you, try matching the pitch of the screaming girl in Modern Family. <coughs> Screaming for long periods of time can lead to vocal damage, so please don't actually scream. It's pretty unusual for people to sing and whistle, especially men. So be patient with yourself and your voice. Once you do find that spot, try to elongate the notes. <coughs> Everyone can sing and whistle. All it takes is time, experimentation, and training. If you have a question about whistle or any other vocal register, write in the comments below. And if you'd like to learn more or get some personal training, check out thecharismaticvoice.com and subscribe to this channel.